Thank you.
Autopsy. With a single stroke of the cleaver, the corpse is split open. The fatty tissues fall away in two yellow folds. In a corpse, the blood is black and does not flow. In a living person, the blood is black and flows from the liver to the spine and from there to the heart and the brain. To penetrate the skull, we shave the head and cut out a disc of flesh the shape of a half moon. We inject the exposed bone with a steel needle and push air into the skull to look inside the brain. Then, with a diamond drill, we enter the bone and nibble at the opening with a hammer, chisel, and knife. The brain is cream colored. It is a balance of chemicals. Thought is affected by traveling electrons. During the brain operation, pressing at this point causes live patients to exclaim at sudden memory. <laughs> if we press here, we get fear. In gunshot, infection ensues unless an operation is undertaken immediately. We excise the wound and suck out bits of bone and the fluid brain matter. If the patient survives, he may live for weeks, or months, or years. He functions barely. He is unconscious or semi-conscious. We don't know. We clean him and feed him. But there is no measure to what degree the mind imagines, receives, or dreams.
I was not involved. I am a small person. I hold no opinions. I stay alive. I was not involved. I am a small person. I hold no opinions. I stay alive. So we stand in line at midnight. I have a dream. He's allowed me to go to the mountain top. And I've looked over. I've seen the promised land. I have a dream that we are, as always, on the threshold of a new dawn. And we shall all see it together.
it true?
looked at the creatures in the garden and at the ground and at the wind and at the water. And she said, I am not the same as these. And she began to examine her ears and her eyes and her nose and her mouth. And she began to examine her own mind. And Eve went to Adam to persuade him to eat. But Adam said, you have eaten of that which was forbidden, and you shall die. Do you want me to eat and die too? But Adam ate, and Adam looked at the creatures in the garden, and at the ground, and at the wind, and at the water. And he said, I am not the same as these. And he began to examine his ears and his eyes and his nose and his mouth. He began to examine his own mind. And he went to Adam to persuade him to eat. But Adam said, I can neither spit out the fruit nor can I swallow it. Woman, 
Have you eaten of the tree where I commanded you not to eat? It was the serpent, Lord. He tempted me and I ate. They gave them a command and I contradicted it. Why did they obey me and not you? Because you have done this, you are cursed over all animals. Upon your belly you shall go, and dust shall you eat. Because you have eaten of the tree of which I commanded you, saying you shall not eat of it, cursed is the earth for your sake. You shall use your mind not to understand, but you doubt. And even if you understand, still shall you doubt. When your children shall be found to murder, you shall make laws, but these laws shall not bind. You shall be made to think, and although few of your thoughts shall exalt you, many of your thoughts shall bring you sorrow and cause you to forget your exaltation. Now shall come a separation between the dreams inside your head and those things which you believe to be outside your head, and the two will war within you. For cursed you shall be alone, for whatever you...